Yeah, I had a bad fall on, not even on a high ball, it was just a regular boulder. I, I landed flat on my back, like a buck, three meters down. The 29th of December 2015, 470 days ago, I lost all the power in my right hand. Climbing was really not existing anymore. I could not believe that, that what I did for the last 20 years is suddenly gone with one moment. I trained really so much and so hard with a minimum of uh, positive results that I thought I will never come back into climbing again. In India I started to focus more on the mental training. A lot of concentrated work. Just visualize how it could be when everything is good again. Mountains give me good energy to calm down and clear your mind the fact was so 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 clear the only way is you have to work and keep on looking forward <laughs> believing in miracles i was so happy to be back on the rock again and uh, there was so much joy every day being out again on the rock Everybody sees something different when they stay in front of this boulder or another rock. You look at it, you see some holes, a line pops up in your mind and then you have something to work on. I, actually, it's only that. <laughs> and then at the end you see what comes out. Fear should not play a role when you climb a high ball. When you have fear, you should go home and think about what you want to do. It's like you stay in front of a big mountain, big wall or a bear, like, uh, it's like you have to be sure what you're going to do now. This is probably one of the hardest track climbs in the world now. When I do those big boulders or risky things, the movement should feel uh, fluid, easy. It must be in a flow. Meditating is a, a big word. Like uh, there are many ways to meditate. Like bouldering itself is meditating, or sitting under an, a rock is kind of meditating. But this year I brought it to a different level. When you are in the moment, in the flow. There is no time to think. If my mind is not 100% here, then I would not go for it. Actually, I have no idea what it is, but it's as a start, it has an end, I used gear because it was too big to fall down. <laughs> I will name the climb into the sun. <laughs> you start in the shadow, you top out in the sunny side. Yeah, last year was not always so sunny for me. The happiest moment is when you see something and wow, maybe I can go up there. And then you try to make it true. 